Welcome back to the show, everyone. This is the start of a new recording session. Hi, the Akamura. She just got home. So, uh, in the last episode, we did a bunch of stuff that required a bunch of time skips, but uh, now, because it's always a few days between every recording session for me, I always rewatch the last episode to try to remember what the hell I was doing, especially in this game. And I realized there was an item combination that may occur that may exist that I do not have yet or that I haven't triggered yet. Boy, can I start this episode over since I can't apparent my English? Anyway. So we have the extendable duck hang hanger and I wonder if I can combine that with the gum and make I don't think that's a good idea. Absolutely nothing. Can I can I that's sponge just it? Stupid. You're just Multi -colored. stupid. Colored all right, I don't know what I'm doing then. So, all right, I am going to take a look at the hint book real quick and just take a look at our objective list. Uh, we've got go one, two, three. Uh, ah, put that back up there. We still need to find a, the, a better gun for the kid. Get yourself a police badge, too. If that spoiled little demon thinks this is over, he's in for a big surprise. You need to get your hands on that toy badge no matter what, even if that makes making the kids suffer. Although I'm sure we all agree that he deserves it. Okay, so... It really does come down to getting... Son of a bitch! It really does come down to getting the kid... Um... A better gun, right? Because that's... Yeah. Goal four. Get the kid a better gun. We've done the hint system all the way up to the lightsaber, although of course we have progressed a little further than that. I'm still convinced that the gun we need to get him is the nail gun. The question is how to get the nail gun out of Bob's hands and into ours. I have a feeling the chewing gum roll- wait, wait, wait! Something's happening. Oh, we sw cute. Oh, Bob is stuck now. Now we can just Sorry, take the friend, nail gun. I need your little gun. You damn punk! I'll find you sooner or later. Uh, I honestly won't even remember me. I honestly didn't expect that's the way it would go, but okay. Yeah, we better not bother a guy who's stuck to a wall. Works for me. You would think that I would have to combine the sponge with the chewing gum roll to actually make it sticky, but whatever. Oh well, progress is being made. Now that we have ourselves a nail gun, we're gonna head down to the subway. To the gross kid. And here's your nail gun, you stupid little bitch. Here you go, kid. This is the ultimate weapon. What an ugly gun. I don't like the color, and it's not very aerodynamic. What? Say what again. Say what again. I dare. I double dog dare you, motherfucker. Look, kid, wow. I had to go through a lot to get that gun, okay? Didn't your parents teach you any manners? God. Mom, this man says you're not bringing me up right. What? Hey, that's not true. <laughs> I said something very similar, but not that. Honey, I told you not to talk to strangers. They're all imbeciles. Yes, mommy. You heard her, you idiot. Get out of here. That gun sucks. You suck. And your hair sucks. You'll never get my badge. Okay. Well, we still have the nail gun, so... There we go. Hey, what the hell? You might the be badge, wearing kid. a plastic badge, but I have more power. <laughs> wow, that gun is awesome. Give it to oh, me. Oh, now you're okay oh, with having it. I love it. this feeling. Now you want the gun, huh? This gun? Oh, but it is an aerodynamic and the colors are so ugly. Nah, I think I'll just throw it away. Don't be a dick. Who, me? <laughs> I think you're wrong, kid. I'm stupid, I'm ugly, and I suck, right? But that doesn't mean your gun isn't cool. I want to see you beg for it. Maybe then I'll let you have it. No way I'm begging you. Just give it to me. We had a deal. All right, here, but be careful. Give me the badge. Awesome. Here, take my water gun. Have hey, the badge? hold it, your water gun. That wasn't the deal. You said you'd give me your badge. If I gave it to you, how would people know who's in charge here then? Kid, oh my god. You said you'd give me your badge if I got you a better gun. I never said that. I said I'd think about it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Give me the damn badge. No. What you gonna do? Oh, you'll see, you little monster. You'll see. 
Okay, I can't spray him with the water gun, I don't think, because it's empty. It's empty. But what if I use the sponge? Now I'm ready there we for go. War. Eat it, kid. Ow! What are you doing? What am I doing? I just wanted to splash you and you shoot a nail at me? Shoot first, ask questions later. That's how I roll. Well, that attitude's gonna get you in trouble one day. <laughs> Ow! Will you knock it off? I just wanted to make sure it worked. Well, it does. Hmm. Let's see, is there anything... I can mix in with that, with the water? Can I pee in it? I would totally pee in it. What if I try shooting him again? It probably won't matter, but do I at least have some sort of information? I could. I mean, it'd be kind of cool, but that kid has a loaded nail gun. I think I'd be on the losing end of that battle. Wait, what if I just spray his mom? Something's happening. I'd love to, but I don't need any more problems uh. right now. But I'm on to something. I probably have to do something to do with his mom. What? Spray him through his mom? No, Randall just wants to go over this way. Shut up, shut up. Oh, God. Oh, God, I thought I was glitching something. Get, get, get back there, Randall. All right. What else do we have? We don't have the gum anymore. I have the tape, tape measure. measure. Like... I wonder what good Locked that is. And loaded. Can we give the condoms to the mom? No. You know. That could create quite a misunderstanding. <laughs> Let's see, what else do we have here? Captain Red Poster. Uh, ah, I don't know. Give the mom the I business read. card? Believe it or not, there was a reason I tried that. Uh, just to hint to her to take the kid and... Uh, what for? Ugh, oh, man. Okay, I wonder if I have to leave this area to figure out what's next. I mean, we've obviously... We, we must have succeeded the one goal, right? Yeah, we, we finished goal uh, four. Right, so now we're on goal five. So I have a feeling something's changed elsewhere. It seems to be the way the game works, that once you achieve one of the major goals things change elsewhere in the world. So we're going to head back to Matt's apartment and I'm going to see, I'm going to see if anything's changed there. Maybe I can spray Matt in the face. Get him to stop being such a depressed Danny, I don't know. I don't know, I can't words. This is a terrible day to do a recording if I can't, you know, speak. It certainly will not and I'm not going to repeat that over the thing on the air. Anyway, hi Matt. Can I spray you with a water gun? No way. I've already chosen my victim. Hmm. I wonder if I can I wonder if that means I can mix the water with something. I mean, does that make any sense? Can I combine this with anything? Can I combine it with a I don't think that Yeah, I Not so if I do not have the sponge so if his victim is certainly going to be the kid oh well let's continue looking around see if anything's changed elsewhere there's nothing in the box we got the baseball I still haven't found a use for the baseball yet I don't think Murray can give me any help uh excuse yeah. I better not. You can't give me any help. Okay, well, where else would there be a thing that's changed? There are some slightly hidden items. Yes, thank you, loading screen hand. There are some very hidden items in this game. Or I suck at my observational skills. Either way. Okay. Is there anything I can do here? My game seems to be taking an extra long time to load shit That's today. the ball the gum roll came in. That makes no... Uh... I don't... I don't... I don't need to measure. What could I measure? What is... What do I have that would be useful to measure anything? Measure. 
Ah, uh, God. I don't like being stuck already only ten minutes into the episode. Let's see. Elaine. I don't want to talk. Okay, she's not helping me. Head in the restroom. It's a urinal. I... Wait, this doesn't make sense, but... That's not what... Mm. That's not... Okay. What if I give condoms to Elaine? No. Okay. Randall's still doing that weird eye roll thing. Oh my god. I don't know what to do. Hi, and I established. He doesn't even know who he's dressed as. The hell with him. I have a feeling I've done as much as I can with him. I mean, wait. That wouldn't make sense, would it? Would there be a reason I would spray no him? I don't think so. No way. <laughs> okay. I, I got the point, Randall. Thank you. Hmm. Ah, uh, what would I need to either measure or do or... Oh, God. Do you have any ideas? I think I might have to kill a kitten. Interact with your surroundings. Sometimes. Now, we've had uh, some of the viewers, especially Kalo, have commented that they wish I had done this on a stream so they could shout at me when I'm being an idiot and save us both some time and give me suggestions. And that's something to very much taken into advisement. Can I get another go? I don't need to. Okay. Um, doing an adventure game that I've never played before for... Uh... I don't think... That's a different statement. I don't think that makes sense. It may not make sense, but that does mean... Because usually if I spray someone, he says that... No way. He's already chosen his victim. Interesting. But still not helping me on my immediate problem. Alright, let's kill some kittens. Uh, try to shoot him again. You have to talk him into testing his shooting. The key is making him shoot at different stuff until he runs out of nails. Okay... Yeah, the banners that- do you want to get mic'd up if you're gonna be talking? I mean, either way, if you don't, that's alright, because you're not really saying much beyond- <laughs> Beyond giving me random suggestions. Anyway, um, but yeah, there's the banner, the baseball... Okay, you're- you should be mic'd up. Hello, everyone. Yep. Did you uh, miss me? Volume balance is good. Oh, well, fine. Okay, let's see if the banners were. Here, shoot at this no, show. God damn it. All right, shoot at the uh, shoot at the baseball. I don't Okay, shoot at uh, the I don't know. Newspapers? Newspapers. What am I? The paper boy? Shut yes. up, Randall. Please don't shoot. Come on. Oh, I had to talk to arrangement him first. here. Ow. Ow! Will you stop shooting nails at me? God. Why? I like doing it. I could do it all day. Snot face. I'm the snot face? Listen, kid, I really need that police badge. It's urgent. What do you need it for? I want to pose as a cop to question the asshole who mugged me yesterday. You just said asshole. That's a naughty word. You need to be punished. Wait, wait, wait. No, kid, come on. No, don't shoot me. Give me a good reason not to. Well, how about because it hurts? <laughs> Ow! Well, at least this is wasting the nails. Oh, God, you'll pay for this. Yeah, what you gonna do? Mm, I'll come up with something. You just wait. I'm so kid. let's. You can't ask me to wait. I have no perception of time. <laughs> what an asshole. All right, let's just burn through the dialogue options. We might get hurt, but maybe that'll empty his ammo. Okay, so you can shoot. Of course I can. You want me to show you again? No, no, enough of that. Thought so. But you know, I'm standing right here in front of you, so don't get too cocky, you know what I'm saying? So, you want to step back a little? 
I bet I can still hit you. Uh, no. Why don't you shoot something else? I mean, something that's not me and not as close as I am. So, uh, I can tell if you're a good shot or not. Okay. What do you have in mind? Oh. Uh, yeah. Shoot the subway sign. Uh, why don't you shoot that subway sign? Piece of cake. Hmm. Looks like it wasn't so easy after all. Shut up. Wow! Look at that! Did you hit it? Of course I did. Hmm. That's weird. I, I don't see any dings on it. Whatever. I swear I hit it. Okay, yeah. I guess I'll just have to believe you. Ugh. So the whole time all I had to do was talk to his ass? God damn it. I feel like an idiot. Oh, do you think you can hit that red X on the barrier? Check me out. Hmm. Close, but no cigar. I said shut up. This damn piece of junk! Don't worry, it's okay. I said shut up! There you Yay. go! Oh, sorry, I wasn't looking. Can you do it again? See? Yeah, well, uh, it's not like you hit it the first time, but hey, if you're happy with that, okay. You're an idiot. <laughs> well, I don't suppose hitting that subway map would present much of a challenge to a child of your talents, huh? Of course not. Oh, damn. It's just because I can't get a good shot in from here. Yeah, I'm sure it's just that. Mm -hmm. I love how no one else here gives a crap about what this kid is doing. Did you see that? I told you I could do it, you dork. Yeah, but I mean, with such a big target, even a monkey could have done that. Hey, don't forget I'm the one holding the gun. I know, I'm just saying maybe you need to practice your shooting there. I don't need to. Okay then. So, no more practicing? Why don't you try shooting that map again? You're so annoying. What if I just shoot you in the eye? Ah, uh, but why? kid, I, I was just... Uh... What's wrong with this thing? Oh, what? You thought it had infinite ammo or what? I... I, I didn't really think about it. Yeah, good. Well, guess what? Now it's my turn. This will be very satisfying. Hey, Except it's weirdly it. animated. Stop it? Are you kidding me? I hate getting wet. Oh, and give me the badge. You hate getting wet, huh? I said stop it. I'm gonna tell my mom. She's yeah, watching like she us. Really cares. Yeah, good point, Randall. Give me the badge. Mom, this man is stalking me. He took my water gun, and now he won't stop soaking me. Sure, Mary Ann. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Mom! Randall's face Hold expression on, is my here. face expression. Will you stop screaming? I'm on the phone. But Say mom again. Say mom again. I dare. I double dare ya, motherfucker. Wow. Oh, hell. Oh, now we know where he gets wrong? it from. Mommy's not listening to you. Oh, poor little baby. Do you want some water? You'll be sorry, I swear. Just give me the badge. Give me the badge. Come on. We had a deal, and you little punk. The misery will deal? stop. No way. I'll never give you my badge. Never. <laughs> So you want to do this the hard way, huh? <laughs> That's enough! I'll tell you when it's enough, and it won't be till after I have that badge. Fine! Here's your stupid badge, you damn filthy pig! Thank Good you. boy! Now why did that have to be so hard? Leave me alone! Get out of here! My pleasure. Indeed. So now we're going to go back to Sci-Fi Con and swap that badge with Murphy's badge and take Murphy's badge and take it to the thief and hopefully get our ring back, although of course it will not be nearly that easy. Nope. Never is. Never is. I just had dinner and I am still hungry. And I'm very snacky. Um, you I want me to need potato head? chips. Do you want me to head out for something? You don't have to. Why? It's 20 uh, degrees outside. Me, 
It's and you're probably you tired from work. Your badge I'm again, from Murray? Alaska. Okay, that is a light I'm from yeah, Pennsylvania, and still. I get nervous when I don't have it on me. Cool. I care about you. Don't go out know, just for me. I wasn't. Don't, don't go out don't just for me. You can trust me. It's fine. <laughs> I wasn't working as long as I usually do, so it's really fine. Here you go, Murray. Very impressive. I'm Thanks, kid. Just feeling now, snacky. Now, if you don't mind, I gotta get back to work. And kind of chocolatey, and I'm not sure why. All right, so we have Murphy's ba Murray's badge. And you got a taste of the conversations the Akamira and I have when we're not mined. Don't go out just for me. I'm going to go out. Please don't go out just for me. I'm going to go out just well, for you. If you're going to go out, then you're going to let me pay. Okay, I'll just take your card and use mine. No, you're going to use my card to fulfill the mission objectives. No, I'm not. Well, well, well. <sighs> What do we have here? Oh, it's the hey, guy who's gonna right murder you unless you card, fuck so off. Oh, is that so? <laughs> Officer Hicks, give me that ring. What ring? The one you stole yesterday, you piece of trash. I didn't steal that ring. I mean, I didn't steal any ring. Officer, I... Uh... Stop babbling. Weren't you just gonna murder me a second ago? You're nothing but a filthy rat. Listen, I'm gonna tell you the truth. Uh, Yesterday, I found the ring in Dr. Fred Edison Street, but it was on the floor. Yeah, it was on the floor right after you beat the owner unconscious. I know your modus operandi, you maggot. Hey, 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 don't you think you're crossing the line a little with all these insults? It's the power of the badge. Now I understand Sergeant Kramer. <laughs> Call don't him mind Susan. mind your freaking business, you punk bitch. Fine, fine, let's I'm not get carried now. away. What? Oh, really? Punk bitch. I like what punk do you bitch. suggest? It's one of my favorite well, Why don't we just talk about it like civilized people? Are you Give me insinuating the ring, I'm not civil enough to, to have a normal conversation? No, 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 of course not. I, I, I... You, 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 what, scum? I, 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 I don't want any trouble with the law. I got a wife and two kids to look after. Uh, I doubt that. You have kids? I don't think so. I'm serious. If you arrest me, who's gonna feed my girls? Who's gonna pay the bills? Look, that's not my problem. Oh, come on, give me a break. Look, let me show you a picture of my girls. They're, they're little angels. Enough. I don't want to see it. I'm sure they're better off without a sleazoid father like you anyway. Hey, hey, hey. Hold it right there. I, I may be a lot of things, but I'm not a bad father. I love my wife and daughters, and they love me. I'm a father and a husband who works really hard every day to give his family the best he can. Is that a damn crime? It is in your case, you little worm. Well, fine. Arrest me. But everything I did, I did for love. Are you pulling my leg or something? Do you really want to get arrested? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm running out of patience here. Oh, c come on, I'm trying to cooperate, officer. What more do you want? What more do I want? What more? I want you to give me my ring back, you sneaky sewer rat. Please, I, I told you, I, I don't want any trouble. I got your ring, okay? I told you, I found it on the street. Nothing illegal. I swear it on my kids. Bullshit. Well, then, give me the ring, then you give douche. me that ring you found already. I don't have it with me right now, but I can show you where I hid it. That's the most intelligent thing you've said all day. Okay. Okay, wait here. I Bob. just gotta pull it out of my hidey hole. Oh, please wait tell me a you minute. just said hidey hole. Yes, officer. The business bum just took... It wasn't there when we searched Houston, the box. We have a problem. Surprise uh, me. You douche I, business I bum. I can't seem to find it. It was right here, I swear it. Do you really expect me to buy that? I always stash my stuff here. I... I don't understand. Well, then I'll tell the Jakes to prepare a bunk for you. Do you prefer top or bottom? And I'm not talking about the beds. <laughs> wait, wait! Someone must have taken it! Yeah, you. And it looks like you're not too keen on handing it over. Well, hey, it's your call. God damn it, wait! I've been robbed. I would like to file a report with you. Excuse me? I said I've been robbed. Me! I can't believe it. Doesn't feel too good, does it? Well? I got robbed and clocked over the head for good measure. But who could have known I put the ring here? Well, the only person around here I've seen is... Oh, shit. What? Nothing. This is none of your business anymore. Get out of here. I should have known that bastard would betray me. 
Yeah, except we sort of spoiled it by looking through the hint book, but that's okay. Let's head back to Randall's apartment, because probably the business bum is going to be in that alley. He'll either be in that alley or he'll be in the, uh... Where was the second alley? Oh, the one behind the by bar. Clayton. Yeah, although I have a feeling he's going to be here by Randall's apartment. Try talking to everyone. Blah, 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 blah. Um... Like, you can use my card at Speedway, and then you can buy yourself a bag of Doritos, too, or something. I'm feeling Doritos. Doritos and tater chips? Or just Doritos? Aw, uh, there's... You did not latch the door. Damn I it. heard the noise, and I saw the light coming out of my peripheral vision, and I'm like, is Foxy about to run through the apartment and murder me? You know... I have not seen Foxy around the apartment. He's everywhere, though. He's everywhere? Everywhere. <laughs> um, Foxy is eternal. God, if I was more of an asshole to my fans, I would just put the Foxy jump scare in right there. <laughs> and, but I'm not that much of an asshole to my fans. <laughs> oh, God, I want to so badly, though. Anyway. You should do it. All right, where are you, business A piece, Foxy. Uh, <laughs> What's up, kid? Looking for something? Oh, you damn bastard. Hey, no need to offend. I'm gonna do way more than just offend you unless you give me what's mine. Yours! <laughs> yeah, mine, and stop laughing already. The ring has returned to its legitimate owner. You should be pleased. Damn backstabbing bum, you know how badly I needed it. <laughs> Relax, boy. You won't be needing it anymore. Oh, you were after the ring all along? Well, what is this all about? <laughs> but you even helped me. You, you, you told me you were some kind of an oracle. What's wrong, kid? Don't tell me this is the first time you've ever been used. Oh, you're scum. But you knew that already, didn't you? Come on, kid. Relax. All that rage running through you right now will fade away in time. Certainly not today or tomorrow, but you'll find love again. You think you're so funny, don't you? I try. <laughs> My patience has limits. I'm warning you. If knowledge is power and power corrupts, how will humankind ever survive? I warned you. Give me that ring. It's mine. You know it's mine. Ow. Ah, dude, not cool. What, now you go around shocking people? Did you think that ruining your life was the only thing this ring does? I know it has its own will. I learned that from you when we were friends. That's true, but you have no idea what it's capable of. This thing has dried up rivers, made buildings collapse, and even wiped out entire civilizations. What the hell are you talking about? Is this thing a one ring of power? <laughs> Look, kid. I don't some know sort of who created some this sort of thing like that. or what powers it bestows, but it's been altering this world's reality for centuries, and almost nobody knows of its existence. Don't you think you're forgetting something, my friend? That I don't give a damn? It's also capable of manipulating people's minds to make them obsessed with it. That's how it forces them to do things they don't really want to do. It can even curse people. Trapping them in some sort of space-time paradox. That sounds familiar. Nobody's ever been capable of taming the ring, but I'm really close. Soon there will be nothing I cannot do. Uh. <laughs> can I just say, can I just say, you're sitting here having a talk in a back alley with a mystical bum. Just focus on that. <sighs> this is happening. This is happening hard. Does that mean you'll finally take a shower? I have way more important things to worry about now. I have a oh, feeling I need sorry, to spray Sorry, Master of the Universe, but neglecting your personal hygiene is never a good idea. Those things don't matter anymore. Okay, if that's what you like to tell yourself, fine. But seriously, you just stink. Ah! <laughs> Smoking! Really? So are you gonna study hard from now on? Excuse me? Yes, you know. To get that degree you always wanted. 
Maybe then you could write that novel you always dreamed about or build a flying car or something. Hey! <laughs> what was that for? I he was does being not like honest. the sass. That was also honest. Honest, cordial, and spontaneous. Hmm. And no more yelling weird stuff at people? Well, a bum has needs, no matter how powerful he is. But we'll see how things go. Uh, if you're not going to take over the planet or anything, I'd like you to stop yelling that I'm cursed every night. It'd be a great first step to being friends again. Never! But why do you do it? There's no point anymore. Besides, now you're this very powerful guy, right? I know! But nothing will make me give up my old habits. I'm not a damn yuppie, and I never will be. Yeah, a well, yuppie? these yuppies don't go around yelling filthy nonsense at complete strangers. You don't get it, kid. No matter how far you get, no matter how successful you are, it's those little things, that mundane, everyday stuff that make this life worth living. Understand? So then yeah, why do you need a mystical ring? from an emotionally disturbed homeless dude. Zap, ah. ow. <laughs> All right, douche. You know, there's something I don't understand. Enlighten me. Uh... <laughs> of course, let's go for the video game reference, Juan. Taking into account the current state of the industry, is it a good idea for new generation consoles to abandon the physical format? Well... Yes? In my opinion... In your opinion, what? Zap. Just don't answer if you don't want to. <laughs> but I did want to! Okay. Um, well, this episode's gonna be a little long, because I don't want to cut this off in the middle of his, uh, dialogue, so let's just burn through the options. Um, are you just floating? I'm levitating! I told you, the ring is powerful! <laughs> well, it's not really that great, you know, it, 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 it's barely noticeable. I'm levitating, not floating! It's not the same! And FYI, it is pretty noticeable. Yeah, if you say so. I do say so! Me! The levitating bum! By the way, uh, have you been floating since I got here? Because I just noticed. You just noticed? Yeah! That's what? weird. Your just perception not an is weird, Randall. Guy. Gee whiz. As I, I want told you, on you once, one just can't escape the universe's nature, where someone sees coincidence. I see consequence. Where someone sees chance, I see cost. What the hell are you talking about? Bring me the eyes of the Oracle, and I will give you back your savior. I what? believe it is a fair and reasonable trade. Yes? No? Ah, oh, enough of your stinking drivel. Weren't you supposed to be the friggin' Oracle? I can't tell how much of this is like a oh, movie reference or on. actual storyline for this game. What were you going to say? I just wanted everyone to know that you made the bum pose. I made the bum pose. I am making the if bum pose now pretty the much. Ring before, why did you get rid of it he in the it first again. place? <laughs> it's complicated. You never know what will happen with this thing. Although I find it very comfortable to cross my well legs like this. Who are you to judge me? Oh, I hadn't really thought about it like that. Sure you hadn't. It's so easy to judge other people, huh? But people in glass houses... Hey, I already said you're right. What else do you want? Uh, ow! <laughs> that! <laughs> you're a freaking dude. If the ring has its own will, how are you so sure it's not gonna fuck you over as well? <laughs> I'm not. I'm just along for the ride. And honestly, my life couldn't get much worse than this anyway. That's true, but you know the ring. Maybe it's already got something more sinister in store for you. Like what? I don't know. Maybe you should have settled for what you just had instead of letting it corrupt you. Those beams don't look so healthy, you know. And what if someday you want to get rid of it and it's too late to? Why would it be too late? Because you might be dead. Hmm. I get your point. And you know what? What? 
Sap. Ow! <laughs> all right, now do I have control over the situation? Yes, all right. I'm going to try shooting him with the water gun since he's all sparkly. What's that, yep. kid? Are you here to show me your new toy? Yes, and I'm going to fry you pretty soon. I see. And what makes you think you'll be able to do that? Remember my toy? Mm-hmm. It shoots water. Ah-ha! Ah! No! I'll be back! Yeah, we'll see about that, business yeah, bomb. like hell you will. And give me the ring. Actually, this is a good place to stop. We'll grab that ring and kick the bum in his twatty little mouth in the next episode. Thanks for watching, everyone. I will, or we will, see you tomorrow for another one. Wow, this is a weird end card. Out of context, there's just this dude in an alleyway standing over a convulsing guy who's completing a circuit. Just... I, I almost feel like Randall's about to whip out his dick and pee on him. Of course he is. Why wouldn't he? That's what I would do.